Hey there, Raw folks. It's good to see you all here again. This is your regular dose of Raw news and analysis. So, I know what you're thinking, not again. Here, we are diving headfirst into a drama-filled world of Meghan Markle and Prince Harry. Buckle up, because this story just keeps getting wilder. Now, if you thought Meghan and Harry's antics couldn't get any more outrageous, think again. We've witnessed two raw babies brought into this world under questionable circumstances, yet everyone conveniently turns a blind eye. The official narrative is carefully crafted, and anyone daring to question it is labelled a conspiracy theorist. But folks, it's time to wake up and smell the coffee. But stop right there before we disclose the juicy details. Make sure to subscribe to the channel, and of course, hit that all-important bell icon. On. Now it's time to get started. Now, for those of you who have been following the Meghan and Harry circus, you know they've been quiet on the journey since leaving the royal family. Now, they've tried their hands at various ventures from podcasts to streaming and, of course, the famous Oprah interview. But here's the kicker it seems Meghan Markle just can't resist being in the spotlight like an addiction. Once an attention seeker, always an attention seeker. So what's the stunt this time? Brace yourself, this one's a doozy. Megan is rumoured to be pregnant again. Now if you're rolling your eyes thinking, another raw baby. Wow, the pattern seems to be clear. Every time Megan and Harry need a PR boost, the baby news magically appears. But here's the thing that's mind-boggling. Megan has already played this card before. Now let's take a moment to remember the circumstance around their previous children shrouded in mystery. There have been doubts, questions, and speculations, but the couple's law supporters dismiss them, claiming it's official. And that's where the real issue lies. Meghan and Harry seem to think they can pull the wool over our eyes, and they've been successful. But the latest rumor is simply too much to swallow. We should believe in a third royal baby when the circumstances surrounding the first two still are clouded in doubt. It's like watching a magician perform the same trick again. But it's not just the pregnancy rumors that have me going crazy. It's also Meghan's consistent mentality. She's known for playing the victim, and it's getting old. Her public statements about feeling unsupported, especially when she was pregnant, are questionable. We can't forget the instances where Meghan criticized others, like Catherine, while being pregnant. The hypocrisy is mind-boggling. It seems that Meghan believes it's perfectly fine to mock. When it comes to her, everyone must show compassion. Now, before I sign off, what do you think about the news? Let us know in the comments, and we'll see you next time for more Royal News and Analysis.